You know, I hate school. Preach into the choir, brother. Like, I wish we could go back to a time that was simpler. Like, a time where there was just no school at all. Unless you got a time machine, I doubt that's going to happen. Well, I know a doctor that he could maybe help us. Let me stop you right there. Every time you say you know somebody, it never ends well. Remember that bullfighter from the gas station? I'm still going to the chiropractor for that. Well, trust me on this one. He, I think he knows what he's doing, and maybe he can help us with our problem. Okay, but if this doesn't go well, I'm blaming you. Alright. So what brings you boys to the lab today? Uh, well, I heard that you could probably help us with our problem. We just really don't like school. I'm just trying to figure out a way to get somewhere else. So you're looking into some time travel, maybe? Yeah, that, that, would, that would help. Well, uh, here's my latest project. It is a time machine, this little contraption here. Time travel or uh, 6,000. Never tested it out, but I mean, maybe it'd be worth a shot if you guys were interested. Yeah, we could do that. I always wanted to be a guinea pig. I mean, if we could definitely give it a try. I mean, she's ready to go. Alright, oh, so right. here's how she works. First, plug her in. Then, open the door, press the button inside. Now we need to press a couple buttons here. What year are we going back to? Doesn't matter, you pick. All right, let's go back to 1855. One, eight, five, five. Press a couple more buttons here. All right, boys, once I take off my apron and goggles, we'll be set to go. All right, grab on, we're leaving in 10 seconds. This is the maiden voyage. Uh. Where are we? Oh, uh, looks like we're outside of Boston, maybe? Back you in think? 1855, yeah, time travel, man. Well, how how do we get back? Where's the microwave? Oh, it's time. We got a timeline. I set it for 20 minutes. We got 20 minutes here in 1855, and then we just come back here and we're back we're back to the to Boyer Town. Alright. Uh, let's start looking around. I'm just right. glad we didn't blow up. Let's do it. Doctor, are you sure you know what you're doing? We've been at this for hours and haven't found anything. I know what I'm doing. You guys gotta trust science. This is time travel. This is science. Just trust it. I will come across something. Yeah, I I'm feeling like we're just never gonna find anything. We found us wanted to find a way to simpler time at school and not find a barren wasteland of trees. Well, what's that right there? Oh. How did okay. we miss that? How did we miss that? Let's go check it out. All right. Wait, do you guys hear that? Yeah, I hear yeah. that. Yeah, hear those noises? You can find this window here. I wonder what's going on in there. Mm, I, mm, I don't know what's going on. Maybe we should check it out. What? Uh, what are they doing with that movie? I, I have no idea. You see that guy's nose? I didn't know it could turn inside out like that. Yeah, I don't like it here, Professor. Can we go back? All right, guys. Well, if you don't like it here, then let's head back to the time machine because we're running out of time. We'll just head back to 2016. All right. 
<laughs> first good idea you had all day. You guys keep going. I'll catch up with you guys. Uh, just gotta take a picture. Sorry. All right. No, all it's right. here. Oh, here it comes. Come on, Come Mike. on, Mike. We want to go back in time, back to 2016. Let's go. You ready to roll? Yeah, let's go. Three, two, one. All right, boys, we're back. I'm scarred for life. I did not enjoy that whatsoever. Mike, I think we should just move on. Thanks, All right. for, your, thanks for your help, though. All right. Yeah, no problem. Come back to live anytime. All right. Good to see you. All right. See you, Dr. Rowan. Take care. Good morning and welcome to Bad TV News for Thursday, December 1st. Today marks the 31st anniversary since the extinction of the human race. Wait, humans are gone? Ah! Don't talk to me. I am busy. Wait, your minds? Doc, why are there robots taking over the world? What? There are robots just everywhere. Where? I don't know what happened with the timeline, but something's messed up. Nothing happened in the past, did it? Um. Uh, Where's my phone? Are you serious? Um, I may have dropped it in the past. You, you're telling me you dropped your phone in the past? I, I just, I don't know. Maybe. Do we you boys? Well, there's only one thing we can do, boys. We gotta, we gotta go back in time, fire her up, and let's head back to 1855. Uh, I think they found us. All right, hurry it up. Hurry up. All right, well, we need to hurry this along. This is an emergency. Oh, look, fire up. Hurry up. I can to keep them off. Oh, my God. Come on, hurry up. It's not working. Why isn't it working? I, I don't know. I, I, oh, that's what it is. I forgot to plug her in. All right, boys, now we're business. Oh. Way to go, PhD. Boom, electricity. We're leaving in 10. Grab one. have to find it. Has to be somewhere. Got him around here somewhere. This is why I hate selfies. I think I found it. Oh, let's hurry. Let's hurry back. All right, we're back. That was terrible. We, I, I feel like we just need to destroy this thing. That'd be best. Yeah. I mean, well, what were you thinking when you built this? Well, I'm sorry you guys didn't like it. I mean, it did work, but maybe it's just best that, uh, it's the best thing for society that we would just destroy this machine. Yeah, we don't want any accidents like that happening again. Good idea number two. All right, well, I got some uh, brooms and stuff here. Let's take a whack, see if we can't put a dent in this bad boy. Three, two, one. <laughs> 